What's up YouTube, it's me King Josh, or Josh, I don't really care what you call me. In today's video, I'll be playing Minecraft, my hardcore world, obviously. Second episode, instantly starting off by going into um, the mine. If the video seems a little different, I did do a different recording style, and it's more turned up as you can see. It's like, uh, like faster cuts, shorter scenes, faster jump cuts and stuff. I don't know if you guys like this, if you guys do, tell me in the comments. And I would do more videos like this. If not, I might go back to the other way. I'll also see by myself which way I prefer. Both ways I like. But the issue with this video is norm all these videos that I'm doing with these jump cuts most likely won't be like this unless somehow you guys like this. But my audio for some reason did not record. I don't know why. I had my mic unmuted. If the only thing I can think about somewhere in the OBS, I had like my mic muted. But I don't remember ever clicking a button like that. So... I don't know what's happening, so I'm having to over voice it or overlay it with my voice or whatever. So I'm commentating it. So, right here I'm just lighting up the cave. Just realized this is the ravine I found last episode. We'll explore that next episode. Spoiler. So, if you want to see me go to that ravine, make sure to tune in for next episode. I finished mining the cave. Um, not that much good loot coal about two stacks about a stack of iron the iron was a little underwhelming each like chunk of iron or vein of iron was about like three like four iron it was very depressing on iron very low like you see iron everywhere but it wasn't that much iron right here i'm over here just mining out trees it's just chopping day gotta clear out my area so i can look at what i'm building because obviously today i have to get my house done can't be living out here with just my chest exposed in front of and a bed on top of the chest can't be living like that. Now I'm getting the pathway set up. It looks like just holes in the ground so far. It's gonna be better, I promise. Adding a little bit of gravel, some andesite. Just making it look like a little natural pattern. Because the house I'm going for is a nature house. It's supposed to be like an environmental house. It's gonna fit right in that cove of water right there. And it's gonna be like layered into the mountain. But not like just stuck into the mountain. So I got like this little walk up. Right here, I'm going to go look at my pathway, what I just had right here. And it's a monstrosity. It looks absolutely gross. It's the worst thing i built so far, hands down. Like, something about it just looks gross. But I promise you, <laughs> it gets better. Um, so anyways, so I keep continuing down to... Well, continuing the path. Making it come down. Instead of just doing a straight path, I decided to curve it. So I towards the edge I start curving it down so it gets like this little shape feature so it's just not flat and because it like allows the blocks to like expand out which adds more shape to it which makes it look way better it's adding more grass paths now here is where I start adding in the fences so I start adding in the fences to look like it's a little gateway in like it looks like it's locking you in but it's not it's just like a natural like trail that you will go down they have fences on it and it's just like not the whole thing is blocked off it's like fences here and there and so I'm starting to like how this looks starting to be fences I don't like this part this part's a little tricky what I am doing I'm trying to fix this up I think going out was a smarter way but then I'm deciding to go in but it still leaves like this weird gap like this weird look to it and then so I go and put the fence post here for some odd reason thinking that will look good I'm literally like expanding it out Maybe if I like did more like pathways going out, but the thing is I'm shrinking the pathway, so right here going in it looks better. But the thing is it just looks so small. So I remove the fence and I move her down here for symmetry. And it actually looks good because it's not small; it's like open. It goes small to like open to like small like there's like this weird snake, I guess you can say, like slithering. And it actually looks pretty good. So again, there's my little pathway done. Now I want to construct in the floor of the house. So I'm constructing the little floor of the house. And this part is also very tricky because I'm trying to like do as much without moving the top part. Or like the mountain because I want to keep that general shape. Because I like how it looks. But that's the hard part is building around it. While keeping its shape and without making the build look ugly. So I start building like these cobblestone to the back left. And now I got like this extra boxy shape. It's like a box inside of a box inside of a box. I decided just to box it all out. Just one box instead of like two little boxes. 
but it's not a complete box because I got that little thing poking out on the right side. So it has like at least some sort of shape. Starting to add in the pillars in. The oak pillars decided to put a block there so I can put the oak pillar there. Oak pillar there. And I mess up right here. I get that. Decided to do the other side because that side is now bad luck. And then bam. So I got the pillars in. And now I'm just looking at it to see do I like it or not. See now this is the hard part. You can see the roofing being dirt. I heard footsteps behind me. That's why I look all paranoid. I thought it was like another creeper. Exactly how that creeper was in the cave. It had that same noise. And I thought it was another creeper and I got paranoid. But now I'm just trying to look at the build. I'm doing dark oak now by the dark oak forest that's like right behind me. Looking at it. It looks alright. Doesn't look bad. But I think I can do better. So just staring at it for a bit. And this is what I came out with at the very end. Oak walls, dark oak roofing. You can kind of see how like I match the roof to like the dirt where it goes up and then like stays. And I don't really do nothing in the back part. I leave that dirt there. So I put dirt right here for a little farm. Go back in. It looks a little claustrophobic. But then if I take away that dirt then it exposes the sun. And that's what I don't want. I want it to be like there. So I do slabs instead of full blocks. So it's not two blocks. It's two and a half blocks. Which actually doesn't look as claustrophobic as I was thinking. And then, so far there's my little house I got. Moving in now. Over here deciding, where do I want my bed? Because that's probably not going to be the main room. But it's going to have to be the main room for now. Because I'm going to expand back down. But I don't know what I'm going to put in there. i got to at least have some design in there. So I just put my bed in there for now. Moving everything out. I put the wheat there where the dirt was at. Teal did put wheat there. Now I'm thinking where should I put the furnaces. I was thinking back there for the meantime, but I end up finding this I end up thinking of like this new pattern. Well not new, probably this has been done many times, but I end up thinking of this pattern that I thought would look really good. I end up getting the chest fast or cut it so you guys don't see me pick up every single thing and move it all. And then Inside, I got my bed above the chest, a chest right there, and then another fast cut to me designing the outside. I'm going to put a boat right here. It kind of looks like the boat is docked to the fences. Obviously, the boat has no utilization here since I can't take it anywhere. It's just a little small pond, but I got a boat right there. I have lanterns. I made lanterns, and now I'm thinking where should I put the lanterns at. I put them on the fence posts in the water right there, and... I'm going to be one right there. There was cobblestone there for a reason. It was supposed to be for a statue, but it didn't come out my way. I might make one next episode. Put one at the very top. And that's pretty much just the video. If you guys like this video or style this video, if it felt weird, sorry, the audio corrupted. And I guess I'll see you guys Friday for the next Minecraft video. See ya.